Hello everybody, this is Rock Hard Gamer 45 back again with another Doom video today. I'll be talking about what I want and what I don't want to be at E3 this year about Doom. Now I'm going to talk about the things that I want to be announced at E3 about Doom. I mean, some of these things are very unlikely not going to happen, but we should hopefully get something along these lines. First thing is, I'm going to talk about single player DLC and expansion packs for the campaign I'm gonna say I know that they said they didn't want to do anything like this and I know they pretty much stated that they are not going to do anything like this but it would still be amazing to see that they have changed their mind or they've been tricking us all this time and they actually have done like a, even it's like five extra levels with a little side story I mean, just something like that. I mean, I think that'd be really cool and really interesting, and something that I definitely would like to see be announced at E3 this year. So we can always hope for that. Another thing I would like to hope for is do monsters. And this one's a bit crazy, but and I think I'm pretty sure they saved this for the sequel. But it'd be really good if they just created a couple of a couple of monsters just for snap map or something like that so people can have a bit more variety of enemies I mean it could be it could be anything really just special imps maybe even something like the nightmare imp this this is something for a bit more variety and of course I'm gonna mention the want bosses in snap map as well which everyone does every single person I think I know wants at least a cyber demon spider mastermind even one of the hell guards I mean, we all know they have, they have simple they have simplified down the cyber demon before, so it could really be possible if we decide to use it in the correct rooms. So hopefully they will announce something like that because that would really be helpful and really really useful. But to talk about my other thing, I really hope they announce free update six. I hope that they use more textures and stuff like that and fix mainly the monster AI. I mean, if, if they just mentioned they're going to patch the monster AI, I mean, that would really, really be, that'd be good in my eyes because they really need to because uh, loads and loads of levels are broken just because of a cacodemon flying out the level or not doing anything, Mancubi walking up to you and not even shooting at you. The stuff like that it can affect the level and it's not even the designer's fault. It's just that the monster's got bad AI. So even if they just announced that they're going to patch the monsters up a little bit, that would be really good as well. I was also thinking about how about a couple of new weapons or something along that line. Maybe the weapons they used in multiplayer they could actually use that. I mean, such as I think it's called the Reaper. There's different weapons along that line. Or maybe they can even make their own sort of hellish weapon like the Young Maker. I mean that'd be really cool. And I'd, I would love that because we don't have enough hellish weapons to be honest. I don't think we have any hellish weapons apart from the multiplayer ones. And I think having a hellish theme le le weapon would be actually really cool. Maybe even along the line of uh, the Soul Cube from Doom 3. Just something that changed up the gameplay. Something that's fun to use. Definitely I'd hope we get to see something like that be announced. I might be expecting something along the line of a one year anniversary a Doom edition. Or a Doom, Doom Slayer edition or something along like that lines of that. Where... There's more missions in the in the campaign, better gameplay, all that the little problems fixed. Just like a new special edition that's been released, where you get the, the the game plus a hell of a lot of extra content. A bit like the new Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Hopefully we get something like that. That might be interesting to have a look at. But now I'm going to quickly talk about one main thing that I hope they're not going to announce this E3, and that is a new multiplayer DLC or anything to do with multiplayer. I hope they don't go at, do, at E3 this year, get everyone's hopes up and go we're going to do four multiplayer skins or something like that because that would be seriously disappointing. Don't get me wrong, I'm not playing here multiplayer here now. I enjoy it every now and then but it's just not that. It's just the weakest part of the game in my opinion. I'd much rather them go, even if they just said we've got one new Doom level coming out or one small update in snap map I prefer that any day of the week any day of the week over multiplayer and I really I know I'm not alone with that I just really hope that they decide to say Quake Champions will be enough let's just focus on the single player 
for now. And snap map. So they're the things that I want and the main thing I don't want. And that's kind of the only thing I really hope they, they don't announce this time. Like I said, I just, I'm just hoping the main things I want is more single player DLC, which I don't think is going to happen, or a snap map update, which hopefully would happen. But my best bet is some sort of one year anniversary edition of the game that comes probably with themes for the PlayStation and the Xbox and the computer. Just something like that, PlayStation themes, a couple of avatars. I've got a feeling it could be something along that line. So anyway, tell me what you think in the comments down below, and thanks for watching this video. Goodbye.